you know, short ball. It was always coming because the field just changed a little bit. This gives you a bit of a clue as to what might be coming. It's a great take from Rishabh Pant. Well, he looks calm enough. Robinson is that type of character. He too looks calm, but there'll be a heck of a lot of nerves and apprehension inside at the moment. Moves are ticking by, 9.4 to go. Umrah is trying to pitch it up as far as he can go because that certainly would have been driven under normal circumstances. That sort of length, they're happy to just block. At least he's trying something a little bit different. That was a drive. He was quite happy to allow it to come onto the bat, angle of the bat facing backwards and just drop it down by his feet. Yeah, I just wonder whether he might go Yorker. Signature delivery, it's what he bowls so well moment again the field changes so no one at deep square now leg gully short leg very straight short leg silly point change of angle as well he has no gone round the wicket Well taken as well. And he's gone straight away. Birat Kohli, we're having a look upstairs. Empire to director, we have a player review for LBW. Original decision is not out. It's a fair delivery. We can move on to front on spin vision, please. Okay, I'm going to need to see Ultra Edge when available, thank you. Keep that rolling through, please. Keep it rolling through. Keep it rolling through. Thank you. Keep it rolling through all the way to the pad. We've got a clear gap between bat and ball. No bat involved. Ball tracking when ready, please. Pitching in line, impact in line, and hitting the wickets. I'm going to go back to Richard on field. Let's change your decision. Well, the brilliance of Bumrah. Just softening Ollie Robinson up with a short ball, and then it was a slightly slower ball. Question for Richard Lillingworth, did it pitch in line? You bet it did. Bumrah went straight up, and Birat Kohli said, yeah, it is absolutely dead, and he reviewed straight away. Good decision. England now eight down. Well, his long vigil is over nine from 35 balls. England now 120 for eight.
Right, Mark Wood, he'd have been pacing around the dressing room for the last half an hour, hour or so. He's out there with Joss Butler. It may be now that Joss Butler has to have a think about trying to protect Mark Wood from the strike. Have a look at the release here from Bumra. It's a slow ball and he rolled his fingers across the ball. You could see the seam rotating as it went down. But it's also excellent control to make sure that you get the ball pitching in line with the stumps. And because it's a, almost like a cutter, it didn't continue straight across the batsman. It straightened a fraction. That's brilliant bowling. Absolutely brilliant bowling. What an over. 120 for eight now. So, Josh Butler has to think now how he's going to try and control and maneuver the strike. It's been Virat Kohli throughout the day. Very animated. Had lots and lots to say. But Bumrah, it's been pretty quiet in the series so far. But is he going to have the final say? Still nine overs still to go. And finally, time has elapsed, so Siraj can now come back into the attack. So Ishant Sharma bowled the last over. Now it's Siraj who's been so impressive in this game. Four wickets in the first innings. Well, I'll be interesting to see what he does, but most cases like this, Butler will try, if he can, to play out the first three or four deliveries. Oh, going down. And then if he can, try and farm the strike. At the start of the next over, that perhaps will give him something to think about. Well, DK said it earlier on. Seems as if every time India take a wicket, they take another one quite quickly after that. Just outside the line of off stump, short of a length. And people will say perhaps he has been leaving balls like that before. He could have left that one. Not this time. Virat Kohli knows it's almost over. One to go, but he knows how close they are. Butler, 25 off, all of 96 deliveries, but his sojourn also comes to an end. Well, what a change. What a change. What a reaction as well from Virat Kohli. He may have dropped Butler when there was still 33 and a half overs to go, but uh, he will now feel a whole lot better. Siraj has been so, so good in this game. The angle angled in to the right-hander and it just left Josh Butler who had a little push at it and it was a simple catch. So Jimmy Anderson walks out with eight and a half or so overs to go. It's going to be mighty tough for Anderson and Wood to see this through. There's Boomer at one end, there's Siraj at the other and joining me in the commentary box, a very happy DK. Oh, well, this is theatre. This is top-notch. This is unbelievable from India. I've thoroughly enjoyed the body language, the attitude, but most importantly, the will to win, being greater than the fear of failure. And that's very important when you play test cricket. Again, Siraj, he's been special throughout this one. A feather, and that's all India requires at this point of time. Yeah, you can see it's good replay. You can see, look at the angle going into Butler. He's forced into play, just leaves him, goes down the slope here. And that long vigil from Josh Butler, 96 deliveries for just 25. They are delighted. India are delighted. They need one more to take a series lead.
there'll be a bit of chat and there'll be plenty of close fielders. Leg gully, short leg, short mid wicket, two slips, a gully. With incredible atmosphere here now. Not a full crowd by any means, but a lot, a lot of noise. What I'm loving about the Sirat celebration is no more a sush, it's happiness. It's pure happiness. He doesn't need to sush anybody. I don't think there's anybody who doubts him. That I can tell you for sure. He's up there, bowling his best. Well, you don't see too many captains react like that. It's very much how Virat Kohli... <laughs> captains aside, and the energy that he gives his side as well. And if India are to win this test match, and it looks likely with eight and a half overs to go, you think they'll do it without any real major contribution from him with the bat. Some runs in the first innings, but not the really big scores that he so often gets. And that will encourage him and his team in an excellent all-round performance. Round the wicket now. Change of angle for Siraj.